G'day everyone. I'm doing an update on the Eucalyptus alba in Cork. And um, I've got to say, now that I've come back here in August, um, in nice summertime, there's evidence of damage to the leaves from the cold frost that we had in winter here. Now, I'll just try and zoom in on that because it's a very sunny day. I'm having a little bit of difficulty getting all of the tree in. You can see that these brown leaves dead patches, especially at the front where it hits the prevailing winds. So that cold wind has been coming through. We had about a week of really cold weather, down to about minus five point, let's just say 5.5. And that was enough to get some severe dieback on the parts of the tree that were exposed. But the main thing is, is that it's come back and I'm very hopeful again it's grown more, the leaves still are nice and green. It has some cuts, some splits in the trunk. Quite a prominent trunk split here. And I'm presuming that's from the cold that we had where it basically gets a lot of water in this position. Um, and then it froze or got heavy frost and that made it all contract because we haven't really had any drought here. So look, I'm going to be reporting back on the progress of this split but I'm hopeful that it will all grow back over itself the way that it has done in the past but it's a pretty significant split this time around. Okay so there you have it I'd say the eucalyptus alba has suffered from a combination of frost and cold weather that lasted more than a week it got down to about minus five and um, because it's in this position here where it gets water runoff from the shed, it, it, re it receives a lot of water. And even though the root system is really strong because I planted it as a seedling, um, it's still going to be absorbing a lot of water because they're thirsty trees. Okay, that's the update on the Eucalyptus Alba.